Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Morden Show. And we have a bunch of new League of Fire challenges here, but my camera person recommended to me the Grumpy Granny Apple Chip Challenge, one of the newest League of Fire sanctioned products here, and it's by Ink, Ink Gardner, the Pepper Masters here on the back. And they are producers of Pepper D, which is arguably the new hottest pepper in the world. I think they're going to try and send it off to Guinness as such, even though it's been argued which one should be hotter. And I'm not going to get into that. I haven't tried to eat any of these straight new peppers, so I do not know which one's hotter. But a lot of people are claiming it's hotter than the Carolina Reaper and some of the other ones. So I do not know, but this is the first sanctioned product, challenge product that has it in there. So I'm going to try it. So what it is is an apple cinnamon chip um, with pepper D. So the rules are, from what I've heard, is you have to eat it within two minutes and then endure a five minute afterburn and we'll see if the rules are in there or not. Oh, and um, while I'm doing the afterburn, I'll show some of the other new goodies I have that I want to do soon. So here it is. The chip and the rules. Oh, it's pretty. So, um, consume at your own risk. Um, rules, no food or drink or relief. Obviously, while attempting this challenge, open the bag on camera. Record without edits. You have two minutes to consume the entire contents of the bag. Endure a five-minute afterburn. Congratulations if you complete the challenge or repeat if necessary. It's got a nice little package. Nice things. The League of Fire. Um, disclaimer. I'm Mr. Brad Warren of 18 years of age. The sound mine if Brad understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers, will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this without question. So mm -hmm. here is the grumpy granny. I don't know whether it's a, like a cookie yeah. or a cracker. Or... See, what's the box of this one? Yeah. Here's the grumpy granny. All right, here's the seal and everything. So we'll crack that. All right, make sure. It's interesting. The chip comes is out. Comes out nice and whole and crispy. Wow. All right, so here we go. Two minutes. Weird. It's chewy. It's got like a white layer inside too. Is it like an apple? Like an apple chip oh. with a bunch of pepper on the outside. Weird. Ooh. <clears throat> What's in your sinuses a little bit? I was forgetting not to breathe on these things. Don't breathe. <laughs> it doesn't taste too bad. What does it taste like? With the apple cinnamon and apple -y. a little bit peppery. <clears throat> With the grandma that might be a little grumpy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kind of cool. It's got a real nice burn. Got some pretty good heat here going. So you have to eat it within two minutes? Mm hmm. So it's chill. Shouting up in mouth. I'm five minutes after burn. Okay. I gotta reset to five. You don't have to wait till the two? Nope. It's not what people. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, in the throat. Ah, a little bit in the throat and sinuses here. Huh. Be a little teary eyed. I'll wait and see. <clears throat> it's definitely got a good burn, that pepper D. It's still building, too. Wow. Pretty solid. It's a three point challenge. I'd say probably be at like 
even with my tolerance, probably a good like three or four, probably closer to a four. So in the mail today too from, uh, so this one's from Ink Gardener, the Grumpy Granny. Um, in the mail today, I also got a couple other goodies. I got the unbearable one, the old Agnes's newest challenge. It's a rice cereal um, wafer, so another rice one, kind of like the crunchy challenge, dipped in chocolate. Oh. That one should be pretty uh, spicy because all the old Agnes Star originals are. And um, that one doesn't even officially have the rules or um, charred up on the um, League of Fire website. Then I got the um, new Got to Be Kidding Me challenge, too. So this one does have the chart up, but it's only worth two points. So I'll be doing those two soon sometime. You've got to be kidding. I think that's hilarious. It's a play on words, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, burn's still pretty good. Still okay. No, it's kind of probably leveling off, though, now. I think that borderline four or five, I would say. The quantity here is not super high, but the heat is. How's it compare? Oh, I know it's probably that. hard. How does it compare to other things with Keller, Carolina Reaper? Or is it kind of hard to tell, really? It's kind of hard to tell because of how it's made and the flavor. Yeah. This one is a burner. It is a burner, and the burn hangs with you, too. I think maybe more than a reaper, the burn hangs in there. Oh, really? Yeah, because I'm not, I mean, I'm like peak now. It's not really coming down that easily. That's weird. Yeah. I got a good nose run here, that's for sure, after a while. Ooh. Camera person doesn't like that. Might be starting to come down, but oh, how's it compared to the Four Horsemen? Well, compared to Four Horsemen, it's like nothing. I mean, but that's the Four Horsemen, of course. Mm -hmm. Like Four Horsemen, I was in panic mode. It was really, really bad. Did the four horsemen prepare you for the grumpy granny? I think so. <laughs> I think so. But yeah, the grumpy granny uh, is a solid challenge. Three points. And for three points, it's a solid challenge. Yeah. Yeah. Hotter than I would expect for three points. But like I said, the quantity is not high, so... That might be what makes it lesser. If the quantity was higher, yeah, definitely would have to be more points because the heat's definitely there. So, stay tuned soon after this. I'll definitely be taking these two guys on soon. Um... And um, this was a this was a good one. Ink Gardener, Pepper D. It's gonna be a solid pepper too. So uh, Pepper D series, Ink Gardener, Grumpy Granny Challenge. It's a solid one. Good flavor. Pretty good flavor too. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. You taste a lot of the apple cinnamon. Was it actually like an dehydrated apple? Kind? I think so. I think the middle is actually dehydrated apple with just a lot of. Apple cinnamon and pepperoni. That was kind of a fun texture. Yeah, it's different. It's different. Yeah. Definitely a burner too. All right. So anyway, hope you have a good night, and we will see you next time here on the Mr. Brad Warren Show.